Hello, I'm Kyle Bradshaw from Chaparral Motorsports, and today I would like to introduce you to the AirFlight helmet from Icon Motorsports. This brand new AirFlight helmet from Icon Motorsports is a unique design that they brought out with features and benefits that they've learned from the existing lines of helmets that they've already got. For those of you looking to have the most streamlined look on the front of your helmet, this new AirFlight is definitely going to do that. There are some key features that this helmet has that no other helmet on the market is featuring. Number one, the visor comes all the way down in the front. That's gonna give the air a nice smooth platform to transition across, which should help this helmet be a lot quieter than some of the others out there in the marketplace. Venting, they've taken to a new level. They've created what they call a recessed twin channel super vent system on this helmet. Basically what that means in layman's term is that they've created a vent here that then splits into two. Half of the air goes down and channels against your skull. The other half stays at the top here. They then meet at the bottom and it pulls that warm, moist air right out of the helmet. The same type of situation happens up front. While this looks like one big vent in the front, it's actually several. One goes straight through to your breath box. The other part of this vent vents upward and directs that air up into the shield, creating a nice, cool, and fog-free scenario there inside the lid. Now, if the weather turns chilly or inclement and you want to close these vents, you simply slide the top ones forward, and on the inside of this chin vent, you can reach up and flip the lever to close the bottom one off as well. In addition to the visor being a unique shape and coming all the way down here in the front, there are two other changes that Icon has made to this helmet that we haven't yet seen before in the Icon line of helmets. The first is gonna be the pop-off side plates. This is gonna be something that is definitely unique for this particular helmet. There are stainless steel bushings essentially on the inside that these plastic side plates just pop into. Another thing that's very unique with this helmet is there are no more tabs that you have to flip or pop out in order to get the shield off. Essentially, you're going to rotate the shield all the way into the up position, and then you're just going to twist a little bit and pull, and the shield pops right off. Now, this helmet here on the table is shown in a Rubitone. It also comes in nine different colorways with absolutely striking graphics. So go take a look at the webpage and look at the different options of this Icon AirFlight helmet. Now, this helmet is DOT and ECE rated and comes in sizes double extra small to triple extra large. Now moving the helmet around to the back, you're going to notice some interesting and striking details here on the back. This spoiler is going to do two things. First of all, the air is going to come over the top and kind of swoop up like this. There's also a deviated channel here on the top, just in between this wing and the helmet shell itself. That's going to guide air into specific locations that will help extract that warm moist air out the bottom of these vents here. While continuing on that topic of airflow, you're going to notice this very unique styling back here. This cutout was not only intended for styling purposes, but it's also intended to increase the aerodynamics of this new AirFlight helmet. Another bonus feature of this new AirFlight helmet is the drop-down sun shield. This is available in three different colors. You've got dark smoke, which it comes with, a light smoke, and even a clear tint. Now the neat part about those three different drop-down shield colors is the fact that you could go super dark on this main shield and then at nighttime open the shield up and drop down your clear visor and you still have some eye protection. Moving to the inside of this helmet, you're going to notice Icon's iconic Hydra Dry interior. This interior is extremely moisture wicking. It's very, very comfortable, soft to the touch and has a great feel when your head is inside this helmet. Not only is it comfortable, it's antimicrobial, and it is all removable and machine washable. This helmet also features Icon's heavy duty D-rings and nylon webbing retention strap. One thing that I really like about all of the Icon helmets is they actually secure by sewing the padding on these straps to the actual strap itself. You never have to worry about those components coming loose or getting out of alignment. Another feature we found on this particular helmet that we haven't seen in a lot of the previous Icon helmets is this chin curtain. This new chin curtain addition is going to allow this helmet to have a little bit more aerodynamics here on the bottom and keep that wind from coming up into the helmet, causing head buffeting. As with most of Icon's helmets, this is going to be a long oval head shape. So let's get inside and look at how that venting structure is molded into the EPS liner of this helmet. 
And there you have it. This is the new Air Flight helmet from Icon Motorsports. Again, available in Rubitoon and nine other different colorways, ECE and DOT rated, ranging in a size range from two extra small to three extra large. I hope that this video has been beneficial in showing you the inside and out of this Icon Air Flight helmet. Thank you for joining us as we've taken you on a walk around of this brand new Air Flight helmet from Icon Motorsports. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more action like this, come directly to your email inbox. Please hit the subscribe button. I'm Kyle Bradshaw. Thank you for joining us. Until next time, take care and ride safe.